Hey there, Ethan here with Carl's Place. Looking for a project that'll take your home theater or dude cave to the next level? Building a frame for your Carl's Place projector screen, installing the screen to the frame, and setting it up for a showing could be your next project. First, you'll need to build a frame. We have an in-depth article that explains how to build one and some tips involved, so be sure to give that a peek before moving on. With the frame built and the edges sanded, we can unbox our Carl's Place projector screen. The one we're using today is our ALR or ambient light rejecting material. Carefully lay your frame centered as possible on the face down screen. There should be a few inches around the frame. Using our staple guide, pull the material around the back of the frame and put your first staple through the material. Make sure to stagger the staple pattern and be sure that the material is taut. Corners can be tricky. You'll need to pull each side taut evenly and fold the excess material over on each other. You'll need a way to mount your screen to the wall. We've used a cleat and leveled our wall mount to install it properly. After being installed, make sure to use a damp cloth, not soaking wet, to wipe away any fingerprints or grease marks. Set up your electronics, and now you're ready to kick back and enjoy your Kyle's Place screen. Hey, thanks for watching our videos. If you'd like to stick around and see more, subscribe by clicking on our logo. For related content, we put a couple extra videos over on the left side of the screen for you. For any of the products that we discussed in our video today, links as always are in the description down below. I'm Ethan with Carl's Place, I'll see you later.